and Miranda. And I just got out of the shower. Nothing on my face, nothing in my hair. I personally don't like to wear a lot of stuff on my face, but I, I love the way makeup will transform a face. So every once in a while I do play around. Everyone is different. You do what you feel comfortable with. And what I feel comfortable with is minimal makeup. First I have to do my hair, so yeah, I have to wait for this to dry first. My hair is really thin, so I don't like to blow dry it when it's wet anymore. I used to do that all the time until I realized how bad that was. <laughs> oh, white hair. By the way, you see them? They don't like to cooperate. I have to force them to cooperate. Oh, the white hairs. People who dye their hair silver, I think it looks amazing. I'm doing that one strand at a time. Naturally. No makeup needed. Easy. Okay, I've gone and done my hair. Um, I don't have a lot of hair. It's all piled to one side because of this. So I use a Conair Spin Brush. It's, I think it's called the Infinity Pro. It's probably better for people who have hair like mine. Thin, layered, um, not very long. Because I feel like if my hair was thicker and longer, you'd have to do smaller sections and be very careful that it doesn't twist so much that your hair gets a little tangled in it. I haven't had a problem, but I can tell that that would probably be an issue for somebody who has more hair than me. So that's number one. First thing I usually do, because like I said, I'm not a professional, I usually do my eyebrows. Now, some people use an eyebrow bar from fancy things from, you know, lots of different brands. I use Maybelline Brow Drama. Uh, this is supposedly a limited edition color. What is it? Deep brown or dark brown? Deep brown. I ha my hair is almost black, so I needed the darkest color I could possibly get, and this was it. Besides this, they do have clear. Clear is good too. It really depends on the day I'm feeling like. Today, let's do dark brown. I'll show you what it looks like. It's this little, this little ball. It's very handy when it comes to eyebrows because it's all you need right here. So. For my liquid liner, yes, I do that next. I know I'm doing it all wrong. What I do is I have this NYX, my, it doesn't focus very well, so I'm just keeping it nice and far away. NYX two timer, it's half felt tip and half pencil and suits my needs. So I really just do something pretty simple. days that you're trying to make your eye your eyeliner even and what you end up doing is making it thicker and thicker and thicker until you realize that, that is not what I meant to do at all yeah me neither know what I do next so out of order do some eyeshadow I feel like it my cat is creeping towards me. I hope you heard that. I forgot to say what I'm using. Maybelline Eye Studio. It's this nice little palette with very light lavenders. There's a green color in there and then a darker color. So I put the lightest color on the inside. Another thing that a lot of girls do that I love the way it looks on them, I never like the way it looks on me, is the whole 
darker in the crease. For some reason, whenever I do that to myself, I feel like it makes my eyes look very buggy and fish-eyed. Um, it just doesn't seem to work for me, so. And I've gotten it professionally done before, and it looks okay, but I always feel like it's too much on my face. Darker on the outside. Eh, mega, mega. A darker maroon. Sometimes I'll use that darker maroon in the thinner version of this under my eye. Just line it right right there. I'm like covering my face up with that. It's wonderful. I'm doing a, such a good job. First makeup tutorial. Can you tell? You can tell? I want a little bit darker on the on the tops too, so let's just So there, eyes. So far I know I didn't use mascara yet. And for mascara, what has, I have actually just repur repurchased it because I really like the way it looks on me. And again, I use drugstore stuff. So Maybelline Big Eyes. It's the double-sided one with the upper and the lower lashes. I will use the upper and lower on my upper lashes because I like the brush on the lower lashes for separating purposes. And I don't curl. <gasps> what? I don't curl. some silly faces when we're putting makeup on. I'm trying my best not to do that, that face, but I do it sometimes anyway. It's like this side is the side that wants to cooperate today. Probably why I should curl. Some people would yell at me for not doing my bottom lashes. Sometimes I really don't. And I, sometimes I only like to do the outsides. One last thing I like to do, and some people do it before the mascara. I'm doing it after, because I'm a freak. Um, I'm using the pencil side of the NYX double liner. And I'm going on my waterline. Don't always put on my top line, because my eyes are big. I like to keep them looking big. And sometimes I feel like that makes them a little sleepier. All right, so my eyes are done. What? Your eyes are done? That's all you're doing? Yeah, that's all I'm doing. Now I have this Revlon Color Stay. Revlon Color Stay over time. And I like to use this color, I think it's Enduring Iris. I don't even use this side, let me tell you. Uh, maybe I'm supposed to, but I don't like it too slick. I just use a little bit of this. I'm not even outlining, I'm not even lining my lips. What the heck? I don't even have a good lip liner, to tell you the truth. I probably should get one. I think it actually emphasizes nice. 
but I don't. Guess what? I'm almost done. This is CoverGirl, no, sorry, oh my goodness, it's Maybelline Baby Lips Crystal. And it's in Mirrored Mauve. Sometimes I'll do this. Sometimes I'll do this. Guess what? My makeup is done. I know. This is all I do. Um, every once in a while I'll put like concealer when I see these little things here, but I often will just leave the house without them because my skin is a little on the sensitive side. If I try to cover these things up, I will just get more pimples. So I avoid it. So that's pretty much what I do. Very unprofessional, but I like it. So that's pretty much it. Then I put on my, uh, my funky little earrings, my ear cuff. I have another one that I made out of a paper clip that I'll wear just as often as this one because it's a swirly little thing. And I know, made from a paper clip. What? Yeah, paper clip. No one can tell. Or they're just too polite to say anything. I don't look like those other girls. They're gorgeous. They put on all that makeup. They look beautiful. Um, I just like to go out and not worry about my face. So that's it. If you like this, then maybe I'll do something funkier next time. Because every once in a while, like I said, I... Sorry, cat's running around going crazy. So maybe I'll do another one one day with something a little crazier. Peace out. <laughs>